Hello viewers and my dear students. Welcome to session 2 of problem 1. Demo on CNC manual part programming for a basic turning profile using Denford Furnip Turning Simulation Software. These are all video tutorials on CNC manual part programming of turning exercises using Denford Furnip Turning Simulation Software. See here, these are all the things what I have already explained. And the problem was this. For this problem, I have already explained how to write a manual plot program. And uh, in this session 2, I will give you the demo how exactly this could be finished. Now, as you know, as I have already explained, this is, uh, that is, along the axis is Z, perpendicular to the axis is X. And if you give the coordinates of A, B, C, D, E, F and using G71 multiple turning, that is a pre-programming, you are able to get your profile. And more than anything else, this program after rough turning will leave an alliance of 0.5 on X and 0.5 on Z. That means, as I said, it is after turning, after rough turning, this will not be 12 mm, this will be 0 0.5, 0 0.5 minutes, it will be 13. During finishing, this 13 mm will be removed to 12 mm. In the same way, if it is 20 mm here, it will be actually 0 0.5 here, 0 0.5 here means 21. And during finishing, that 0.5 will be removed so that the diameter becomes 20. Okay. That means if the depth of cut will be 0 0.5, the diameter reduction will be 1 mm. Okay. And also I have told you, during rough turning, the depth of cut is increment of 1 mm. That means depth of, depth of cut is 1 mm. And feed is 50 mm per minute during roughing and 30 mm per minute for finishing everything. I have told you. I have already given the program for this. You see here, this is planning and operation sheet where you have only two operations, rough and finish turning. These things I have already explained. Okay. And this, this billet size, everything. This entire program I have already explained. As you see here, the home position to this position, it will come rapidly. The tool will come rapidly to this safe position. From there, it starts executing. And I have, uh, that is using G and M codes. I will write the coordinates of A, B, C, D, E, F. As you know, at the, uh, that is here I have written no, G71. These are all the block numbers or sequence number N10, N20, N30 and all that. And these are all the initial commands which will be same for more or less all the problems. And G00, X22, Z2, I have chosen because this is already 20. And uh, the, this is, sorry, this X22, Z80, why I have cho chosen as This is 54 already. And I have chosen 80 because it should be more than this Z. Because it will, some, some portion will go to the check. Uh, and this is 20 already. I have taken 2 mm more. In that way, billet size, I have taken more than the, uh, looking at the drawing, Little more, uh, 2 mm more, 20, it is 22, 54, I have taken 80. Okay. And everything I have explained already in this. Okay. And uh, this, see, as you see here, these things I have already explained. G01, X12, it is A. And B is X12, Z minus 10. Okay. C is X16, Z minus 20. And D is X16, Z minus 35. Okay. Then... E is X20, Z minus 50 and yeah, F is X20, Z minus 54. That means it is between the, between the block numbers 80 to 130 is the actual program. A to F between uh, 80 to 130. You see here from 80 it starts, 80 it starts X12 A at 130. It is F. Okay. In that way, rough turning is uh, done with an alliance of 0.5 and both X and Z. Then one line you see here in block number N140, G70 is the finished turning. P80, Q130. That means between the block numbers 80 and 130, you do the finished turning. That is what we are giving the instruction to CNC machine. So that between 80 and 130, between block numbers 80 and 130, with a feed of 30, it will do the finishing. It will do the finishing means that 0.5, whatever is left on X and whatever left on Z. Okay. That will be removed during the finishing. 
and exactly the component with highest accuracy you will get it. Once you get it, it will go to the neutral, that is home position and all that. It will stop the spindle. It program stops and rewind and all that. Now I will show you how exactly it has to be done. The simulation part I will show you. Okay. Now as you see here, I'll what I'll do, you, you have to go to the docs box here. Okay. Docs, docs box you go. Okay. Here you uh, uh, enter mount. Okay, mount D, D colon slash you do, then D colon slash you do, then CD lathe you do, then Fanuk L, Fanuk L with lathe dot EXE you do. You are getting the Fanuk simulation screen. Okay. Then Alt Enter you do, it will become bigger. Okay. Now once you do this, the program whatever I have just now told you, you enter it here. That means you see here function F3. If you do file number for load, I have already loaded that program. That is 01 turn BJ. This is the thing what I got. Okay. Now this has been done already. Okay. Whatever I have explained, you see here. This is, as you see here, this is, this is, a, that is between 80 and 130, the program. This is A. This is X12, Z minus 10, B. This is X30, 16, Z minus 30, C, D, E, F, in that way. Okay. In that way, you have, whatever I have entered already, whatever I have taught you already, I just enter it in this screen. You just enter it in this screen. Once you enter it, take the cursor to the top position. Okay. Study this. Okay. If the uh, program, if you have written correctly, then you go for F fun function F8 you go. It is function F9 you go. That is F9 you press. Take syntax you do. Your CNC program is okay. Okay. That means the CNC program, whatever you have done, it is okay. Then function, again you do F9, dry run you do, it will go to that. And that means, once you go dry run, this will be, the diameter of this will be exactly, the diameter of this will be 22 and the length will be 80. This is the uh, screen and this is, this is the, uh, the screen, on the screen whatever you got, that uh, work piece you got. The diameter is 22 and the uh, length is 80. Okay. Then again you go for F9. 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 Set pulling. Set pulling you see here. Set pulling. You, you have used a tool 1. The tool 1. You just see it is a roughing tool. Roughing tool it is okay. If you are not interested in roughing tool. You can take finishing tool and all that. In some other problem you get a finishing tool and all that. You can choose that. Now, uh, roughing tool is there. You just say okay. Okay, roughing tool is okay. Just say escape. Now, once you do all this, everything is ready. Now, again, you go for F9. Okay. Run program you do. Once you do the run program, you, you can clearly see this. Sir. Once you are seeing here, you key at the bottom, you carefully see X and Z you keep observing. Since the di diametrical increment is diame uh, 1 mm, okay, it, the diametrical in increment is 1 mm, uh, di every time it reduces by 2 mm. And also if you see here, now as you see here, I will show you the demo again. Run program, you just do. Now you see here, once you do here, x20 you, you can see, correct now, next x18 that means x18 2 uh, 2 to mm diametrical reduction because depth of cut is 1 mm and at the same time you can see here 9.5 19.5 34.5 and all that on z that that means that is aligns left on z in that way you are able to see the simulation properly i will you show the simulation again 
you see here, if you show the simulation again, show the simulation, observe the alliance on X also. That means it will be 0.5. You carefully keep observing X. Huh? X will be, you carefully observe. Uh, you see here X to 12.5, 16.5 and all that can you observe. Okay, that is alliances. And during finishing, X16, X20, X22, exactly it does it that way. In that way, you are able to do the simulation properly and you are getting exactly the way you wanted. In that way, we have finished this. Okay. And if you want this, uh, the 3D view also, 3D view also, you can get it. This is the way it has to be done. Okay. Now, we have come to the end of session 2, where we have entered the program and we have done the simulation using FANUC turning simulations or software. Thank you very much for watching. Thanks, friends. Thank you.